Common Core State Standards, Math, 7th grade, Expressions and Equations 1 and 2, um, Graduation Standards, Algebra 1A, Properties of Operations, and we're looking at the first example. And we're looking at the properties, and so far the properties of the laws, um, and uh, associative and commutative properties, and they're good for both addition and multiplication. All right, so let's look at this here. We have the expression 2 times 5 times n equals 2 times 5 uh, times n. So the, what has changed is the grouping, uh, the parentheses. So we're going to work inside here, and we get 5n, and bring down the rest of the stuff, times 2. Does that indeed equal uh, 2 times 5 would be 10 times n? So when we multiply this together, we get 10n, in fact, does equal 10n. And uh, so this property here is the property, uh, associative property, associative property. Oh, see, I, all right. And if we had two numbers that were flipping, then it would be the community property. And this is actually the associated property of multiplication. And you can go through all of them. It's pretty simple. Let's go through one with commutative. Uh, it would be something like 3x plus x equals x plus 3x. Already, you look at the expressions here. We have some algebra going on here. And sure enough, 3x plus x equals 4x x plus 3x equals 4x, it is the same thing. And what's flipping here is the numbers, so it's commutative. Commutative. Property. And this one here would be addition. Why addition? Because you're adding. And these two properties are not any good for, um, for addition, um, division or <laughs> subtraction. And the second problem would be, let's go through here. Um, it says, state whether the conjecture is true or false. Okay, so it says that 15 divided by 3, does this equal 3 divided by 15? Well, uh, if you take this side here, 15 divided by 3, you're going to get 5. Does that equal um, 3 divided by 15? Well, that's 1 fifth. Uh, do those equal? No, they do not equal. So 5 does not equal 1 fifth. So therefore, commutative is not good for division. All right, uh, so a counterexample, and another vocabulary word you have is properties, and you also have counterexample. So this here is a counterexample of the property, uh, the commutative property, because it doesn't work. So counter means it, it doesn't work. It's the opposite of true. Thank you.